Okay, so I think I have a suitable cut position for the uh, section, the middle section, and the uh, and the the back box, the back part section. If you look here, this is the this is the back box, and the cut line is supposed to be. Here. So the this is what I've called the back box. This part here, um, because it's but you know, behind the occupants. One, two, three. Um, what that means is that on the floor, the floor and the driver support part here uh, are one assembly. Is that I can't attach that this pipe here to that I can't attach that one I can't attach that 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 <laughs> likewise on there 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 one two three two three thing and on and on that one and then there's going to be more here that can't be attached there's one two three um, four and then there's these ones one two three and those ones and think and then there's another layer coming up here which has got the roof part on it um, uh, then the roof line comes down so there is a massive number occurred to me just looking at this that the reason why this was so so why it was so much simpler there is because we just had one two three four points um, and so I was able to put one rod on there, one rod on there, one rod on there, onto the front assembly and put those epoxy, those tiny pieces on, and it was all, um, and then just um, cut that off there, um, which now I realise was a mistake, but never mind. And similar on that side also, um, I think I should have... Um, I should have uh, prized that off, but that's okay. Uh, <coughs> that, that was drastically simpler. I suddenly realized that we can do the same thing here. So I'm going to un... I'm going to cut that tape off there. I'm going to leave that on there. And I'm going to epoxy a another bar I'm trying to cover that one up visually for you. I'm going to pro pro proxy another bar from there to this one. And you can see I don't need any uh, bracing on, uh, any further bracing on there. Do need some bracing on uh, this, the, 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 the triple thing is covering it. Do need some uh, a bracing piece epoxy from there to there. Do need that one because this node is going. So epoxy from there to there, from there to there. Uh, another bar across there. Then epoxy from there to there. Put another bar across there. And then take that off. Now, um, I'm not sure whether I will, I will undo that one. Um, and I will, I'm not sure whether I'll cut that one. I think I might actually learn my lesson. Um, uh, and not do uh, not cut do cutting on these. Um, but once there's a piece of epoxy on there, the only thing about epoxying is um, that the angle has to be absolutely perfect. Unfortunately, when this is glued onto there and there, the angle of this when that's glued on, and that's glued on, and that's glued on, it will triangulate this, and the angle of the floor will be correct. At which point I can actually um, epoxy things across here. You know, another pipe across there, and it won't um, won't snap off. So I think that's the simplest um, simplest way, um, and it it actually takes the the entire uh, the driver support piece comes off 
um, a, a thing just leaving a flat floor and then we'll have a flat roof so it will be actually four pieces front one floor two roof three um, rear section four Ooh, sorry I've put phase two out of three and everything but hey <laughs> that's alright so yeah thank you